rapper like me So you can point the finger and say that's the bad guy I tell the truth even when I lie Everybody say goodnight to the bad guy You need people like me So you can point the finger and say This song came to me from my good friend Iwao He'd watched some of our earlier videos And he said look You've got to do this song. It's like the first rap song in Japan. It's by a guy named Yoshi Ikuzo, and its Japanese title is Ora Tokyo Saiguda, which basically means I'll go to Tokyo. I have to make an apology right now to our translator, May. Cue the picture over here. That's the beautiful May. This video is kitsch or kitschy. There is no Japanese word for kitsch, and you have to understand what it means. Kitsch, kitschy, is when something is so so beyond belief bad, garish, I mean, in your face, awful, that in a self-knowing, ironic way, it becomes beautiful. And that's what this, this video is. Yoshi Akuzo, who's the singer, is dressed in traditional Tohoku garb, and he's speaking what's called Suguru Ben, which means the Suguru dialect, which is so different from Japanese that many people in Japan south of Tohoku can't even understand exactly what it is that he's saying. I might have to cover myself up because Lord Spade's brains may well explode and I'm gonna have brain matter and mess all over me. This song is just beyond belief. I have no predisposed feelings about this song. I'm actually intrigued to hear how the first rap song in Japan comes across. Well, this is going to be a journey for all of us. We all going to grow a little bit and hopefully become better people after stop this bullshit. This is what you. You need people like me so you can point the finger and say that's the bad guy. All right, man. This is going to be interesting. Yeah, it is. Hold on, let me get my headset on. This is uh, yeah. this this is this one's interesting, and I'm going to be watching my friend through the video. Don't watch me. Watch Mr. Uh, Ikarashi, whatever his name is. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yoshi Kusa. Tokyo tour, huh? Oh, I just the tempo, huh? Whatever, I just say what I want to. I like the song. Huh? <laughs> 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 At first, man, you know, I'm not ages, but it was like he's 69 years old. Which, you know, props for kicking on bars at 60, but. So, I've been in Japan 14, 15 years. It's changed a lot over that time. That's 1985, and let me tell you something, it's a whole different world. I love the contra. I, I love all those shit eating grins in the background. <laughs> Yeah, she's, she, she's love it. Oh yeah, but in a, you know, in this kind of condescending way. Not really condescending, man. I just love the contrast in that song between the singer in the traditional costume and all, as I called them, the urban sophisticates behind him. And as far as I was concerned, that was a condescending kind of smirky look. Oh, look at the hick from uh, from Amari, from the uh, the north of the Honshu Island. The setup for the whole thing is he is on a television show. 
in Japanese TV, there's always somebody in a suit dressed so well. So it's not really being condescending, it's just a rundown of the show. That's how Japanese shows go. Ask me how I know. Iwao, thank you so much for suggesting this song. Uh, I, I gotta know, what'd you think? Well, I mean, nobody's better for watching that, and I wish I could get that four minutes of my life back. That was um, <laughs> just garbage. But, 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 this is, this is the thing, right? It wasn't bad in the sense of the time and context. It was something, I'm quite sure, it was new to Tokyo. It was something, guys. <laughs> this is what I figured, speechless. I figured when, I, when Iwao suggested this to me, I thought, whoa, this is something else. Yeah, it's something else. <laughs> uh, for what it was in the content and the time, it's not bad. It's not good either. It's just, Hashira Mayor, you never knew why. It's like, bruh. It was a hit, and, and actually, it, uh, within the last 10 years, there's a whole slew of remixes by Japanese artists based on this. Of course, man, because a lot of times it doesn't work on talent, it works about who's first. Yeah. It's all about yeah. like who jumps on the bandwagon first. So if this is the first guy, of course, now he's the grandfather, but right. he's not good. This guy is not a good rapper. I know good Japanese rappers. Anarchy, good Japanese rapper. Code, damn, it hurts me to say that. Good rapper, you <laughs> know what I'm saying? Definitely bite off Americans a little too much, besides anarchy. You, you my friend, are golden. But a lot of Japanese rappers bite off American rappers so much to the point that you can just tell you're carbon copying and whatever's yeah, right, hot right. in America, that's what they did. Like right. when DMX was hot, people was barking in, in Japan now. Since the Migos are hot, they're copying the Migos style. You have no idea what I'm talking about here. Again, not a bloody clue. You see the kitsch? No. I don't. Really? I don't. You don't see that as kitschy? It's not kitschy. Oh, I think it's really kitschy. It's not kitschy. No? No, it, it's, for me. Just bad? It, it's just, it was, it was fun. If I had to rate this song, being one of the first Japanese songs out here, and being in the 80s, taking the content, I'm going to give this a five. Okay. There was only one other song where we agreed on, and that was Bob uh, Seeger, Night Moves, where we both huh. gave it a nine. And on this one, I think it's kitschy. I disagree. I appreciate my friend Iwao giving me the song. Shout out to Iwao, man. Yeah. Thank you for re uh, recommending this song. But I'm going to actually, again, agree with you. It's a five. It's about a five, It's man. a five. It, it, it's a five. You can't go no higher than five. No. You can go lower, but you can't go yeah. higher you, 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 than five. I agree. You could go lower, but no, you can't. Five you, is a good one. Yeah. It, 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 it encompasses everything, yeah. it, it contextually. It, it, yeah, it's not a bad song, but it's not a good song. If you want to check out what we both think is a great Japanese song, check out our video for Pizzy Kato 5 Twiggy Twiggy. That's a terrific song. And more Japanese music is on the way, guys, because we are Tokyo Stash and Spade, because we're actually in Tokyo. Along with Ryan. Ryan, you're in Tokyo too, right? <laughs> His the, head. the usual Ryan passion. Yeah. That's that Ann Arbor, Michigan cheer. Did you know Bob Seger's actually for Ann Arbor? Yeah, I read one of the comments. Yeah. yeah. Thank you yeah. for giving us that knowledge. Yeah, but we really appreciate all the comments. So, why can't you sing, Ryan? <laughs> I mean, Bob Seger came from your, your hood, homie. From your hood, from your hometown. Why can't you sing like Bob Seger? You know what? You're fired, Ryan. <laughs> You're fired. We're, we're firing our cameraman. Yeah, That's it. Because he doesn't sing like Bob Seger. You need people like me So you can point the finger and say that's the bad guy I tell the truth even when I lie Everybody say goodnight to the bad guy